Well, another year, another Old Dominion University Lit Fest. Um, the event I went to in the Lit Fest was a poetry kind of drum playing, uh, reading thing by a man named Jamal Muhammad and Tim Siebels, who I think was the director or the coordinator of the entire Lit Fest. Um, basically, it started out with Tim introducing um, Jamal slash introducing, you know, this whole theory on music as speech, um, you know, sound, and also the lyrics can you use to communicate with people, not just regular words. Um, but when he was talking, it was kind of hard for me to hear. I think it was just because of his voice um, and his, not accent, but the tone of his voice was already kind of low. But he had interesting things to say. Um, Jamal Muhammad, what, all he did was play the um, drums. It was really impressive. He was really good. But I don't know. I guess it was just maybe it was just what he was doing, like the whole drum playing. It really didn't appeal to me very much. I could appreciate that what he was doing was very difficult. Um, it was really interesting. But I wouldn't exactly like listen to it again by choice. It reminded me a lot of like a drum version, version of like Inception soundtrack. Uh, but I like the Inception soundtrack a lot better. The physical setup was in the Chandler Recital Hall, which is in Dean. Um, it's like a three, four hundred person theater. It was very full. Those like the aisles were full. They even put seats on the stage behind the uh, Jamal, which he was playing the music, which I thought was weird that you put people behind where the music is being projected to. Um, I think it was full because everybody in literature and English classes had to go to a lit fest, and that was one of the last ones because it was on a Thursday. But um, the playing basically was a seven-part uh, piece where Tim would say a piece of poetry, and then Jamal would play, and just back and forth, back and forth, like a conversation. Overall, it was interesting. I'm glad I went to it. It was something new, but I didn't necessarily like the performance. I think it was good. I just, once again, I can't reiterate enough that I can appreciate that it was good, but I just didn't like it very much. There was an old lady on stage, which was really distracting, because she kept falling asleep in the corner, um, doing one of those, like, where she was kind of leaning forward, and she would shoot back up really quickly. But, other than that it was good, uh, it was interesting, well set up, aside from Tim speaking at first. I could hear very well. The acoustics in that hall were really good. Um, could see easily even though I was in the aisle. Um, overall, I would definitely recommend going to one like this. Although, I heard some of the other ones were very good. This one was really good. Um, as far as interesting and something new that most people have probably never seen before. Um, he also played a pot. Like a, like a kitchen pot. I just remembered that put um, water in it and he made the sound, made it, made it sound differently. That was really interesting. But um, aside from that, I would give it a 3 out of 4 um, on an overall if I had to rank it, or you know, maybe a 8 out of 10, something along those lines. But overall, recommended.